what is up guys welcome back to another video uh it's your boy spaghetti here and um i wanted to record something today and i know reactions isn't really my type of video i don't really do them i do more like gaming and stuff but i wanted to try something new maybe you guys like it maybe you don't um so we'll just see what's up and it's uh 11 11 scary videos you should watch alone um by chills he has a, clearly he has a bunch of followers. You see that? Damn. Yeah, that's the dream right there. Um, but yeah, it is currently fuck. It is currently two thirty right now in the morning. So I don't know why the fuck I shouldn't be. I should be. I don't even know why the fuck I'm watching this. Um, <laughs> uh, but yeah, let's just see. Let's see what this video has to do. Without further ado, let's just get into it. This list of scary videos is too scary for you to handle watching alone at night, so don't be afraid to grab a friend and share the scares. Number I like his 11. voice. <laughs> I love his voice where he's like, These videos are so scary. You should go and follow me. You know, it's like his voice is his voice is pretty cool. Alright. Then a surprise hiker caught this creepy sighting on video along the cliffs of Ditifoss, Iceland. What, what am I looking at? They are taking in the sights when they see small movements that they find strange. What am I supposed to look as at? As explorer gets closer oh, to that investigate, the they see what that? they describe as a little creature peering at them from the other side of like the Black cliff. Panther, boy. They say nobody else what was like on the Wakanda, trail at the boy. time. Like, boy, so what does this look like to you? It could be Bro, the tail of an animal, or maybe somebody holding up a creepy doll, or maybe yeah, it really a is some or kind of human creature holding on for its life. I mean, it's not that when scary, they zoom but... all the way in, they manage to get a glimpse of a head full of dark hair that looks like it could belong to a person, no. though it could be a doll hair if this is fake, whatever it hair. is. The unknown creature quietly disappears and is not seen again. Okay. Number 10. A man on a motorcycle sees a stranger running on foot and then sees what they are chasing after, <laughs> their own horse. Without <laughs> hesitation, the brave horse. man accelerates and quickly catches up to the horse, Damn, who bucked its rider is and is now running Boy, scared, running. but the sound of the motorcycle scares it further, and they round oh, a turn. Shit. It looks like the two are going to collide, which would have not ended well for the man. The creature slows down in its confusion so you can't be and then takes this off at, like, again. Alone? Meanwhile, a guy the man a picks horse. up the you, you owner be and the chase is on again. Alone. With the woman still on the back of the bike, they manage to grab the, the horse fuck? by the reins and calm it down long enough to stop. This is a risky maneuver that could have easily ended with her falling off the bike, right. so I'm glad it worked out well. Right. Number nine. Number nine. Exploring abandoned houses oh, for no. paranormal okay, so this evidence where, is an activity this that's as old as This is where it gets to the fucked up part. You see? Hell no, nah. I can't do a bound in houses, bro. Hell no, nah. fuck that. Let's. All right. YouTube itself, as this early video taken in August of 2005 shows, the team of amateur ghost hunters are exploring an abandoned house from the street when activity within lets them know it's quite haunted. At two seconds, one. What was it? It looked like. It's probably a homeless dude, bro. One of them points to an all-white apparition and they all take off. Yeah, man. I don't think this is fake because video editing was not that common back in 05. And when you oh, play shit, it was, in slow motion, shit, you can oh, actually five. see the mysterious... Fi oh, 05, what was I doing? Shit, I was... I was like four years old. What the fuck was I doing? I was probably watching Spongebob, you know, sucking on my thumb. Figure, go from right to left across the doorway. It's bizarre, right. sure. But was it a ghost? Number no, eight, it was probably just a homeless an urbex YouTuber called RNK All Day is exploring a creepy building that used See, to be a funeral home Fuck before that. it was that abandoned. That takes... the f man, look, to be these kind of YouTubers, man, to go inside um, abandoned houses by yourself. He's, look, he's by himself. Like, he has equipment, yes, but he is by himself. Fuck that. That takes balls, man. That takes, that takes another kind of person to do that. And, hey, that's dedication, man funeral home is not haunted per se at least not from what i can the tell fuck? but what they find is every bit as scary as any ghost video you'll ever watch right you see a long time ago this north carolina establishment was shut down because of improper business operations people were not notified about their loved ones in a timely fashion mm -hmm. and the remains were often not stored properly at all yeah 
As RNK All Day explores the abandoned building, he finds evidence of their misdeeds laying out in the open. Sitting it, in a coat? battered cupboard box on an old altar is a discarded Somebody plastic bag narcotics. full of what appears to be ashes. Oh, you saw that? There's no way to tell if these. Oh, hold on. Was I the only one that saw that? Rewind that real quick. How do you. Oh my god. Let me, let me rewind it. As RNK okay. all day explores the abandoned building, he finds evidence. Or is that him? Is that is that somebody back there? You'll see that in the corner, in the right corner. Is that him? Is that is that is that a reflection of himself? Evidence of their misdeeds laying out in that? the open, sitting in a battered cupboard box oh, yeah, on an old else. altar, okay. is a no, discarded I'm I'm plastic I'm bag full of what appears to be ashes. Well, I it was like There's no way to tell if these like are the ashes Damn. of someone until you look at the box that definitely says cremation services. If this is what we think it is, which I think it almost definitely is, then they should what? be properly placed in an urn, not out in the open like this. What is it? And if there are more items like this lying around, then maybe this building is haunted after all. Right. Number seven. A YouTuber named Joey Cuncialdi is joking around with his friend when he pretends to dive under the covers to be silly. What? As he is doing so, the thin bizarre outline of a scrawny shadow person is seen behind him for a split second. Oh! And by the time oh, he comes no, back up, it's no. gone. Joey is certain that this ghost sighting is real, but I'm wondering if it was just the banister seen a few seconds later. I don't know, man. It looks to be well, in a different position and not as dark, probably and therefore probably was not it. Number six. Number six. Urban explorers Stacy and Cliff are exploring the abandoned Bryce Hospital, uh -huh. an Alabama asylum that is haunted as can be. Little do they know a shadow Who person is man? following them all the while and can be seen caught on video multiple times. What? When they first enter the building, a paranormal presence compels Stacy to not only look to her left, but to call out as well. Hello? A partially hidden shadow figure stands in the doorway. As soon as she says hello, the screen blurs like movement is near. She feels the need to look again, but this time the mysterious shadow figure is gone. Oh, On a different floor, that. they see a strange passing shadow move across the doorway. Do, that's why I can't do abandoned places, bro, because you don't know what the fuck you see. And then, like, if you do see something, you don't know if you're, like, tripping or if you're over-exaggerating. You know what I'm saying? Like, fuck that. I, I, can't, I can't do that, man. Though this bizarre movement Plus, could... if I know it's haunted, why the fuck am I going to go in there? If I know, if I know there's, there, there, there could be a chance that something is in there, why the fuck am I gonna go in there? Simply be yeah, a trick that. of the light, and not necessarily paranormal. With that said, a few minutes later is when they see the shadow figure one final time. A ghost in the doorway watching them without a word, and as Stacy turns around, the shadowy figure smooths out and mysteriously disappears. disappears. They finish exploring the hospital without another mysterious figure sighting. Uh -huh. Number, five, Number five. This 2009 video is some of the earliest and most bizarre evidence of the weird and mysterious lights at the Skinwalker Ranch in Utah, which Skinwalker is considered Ranch. a hotbed of paranormal activity the all around. Perfect spheres of lights like this one often are sighted in the sky or sometimes on the ground strange right. lights that have never been explained the mysterious lights don't look like anything made by a person because they are almost as tall as a tree and extremely wide much bigger than even the largest of spotlights so that's it. We're just looking this at lights? next video taken fuck? by the uploader's brother shortly after spending a day at the skinwalker ranch shows an object moving on its own in their basement swinging for 15 minutes now is that a punching bag so a punching bag moving. More unexplained lights have been haunting his basement. What? Did something paranormal follow what the him home? This man. <laughs> this man is being haunted by some lights? What kind of shit is that? What? Man, he better be lucky he at least got lights, bro. Shit, if this shit turns off, I know he's gonna be bitching. <laughs> Number four. Number four, Chelsea Luna and her friend James go ghost hunting in an old haunted tunnel yeah, from the see, 1920s. This creepy shadow figure at fuck 18 that. minutes and 7 seconds is what they find. 
Everyone says that this is a real ghost sighting, but I'm pretty sure this alleged apparition is simply Chelsea's finger while pointing at yeah, something. Yeah, you can kind of see yeah. the rest of her hand when that you look like close, it was just her finger, a split second fool, before bro? it happens. Or maybe it's a homeless guy. So I think guy. this scary ghost sighting is an accident and not real. Nah, but that's just a finger. Number bro. three, nah, Crazy George's it. Bridge is the name of a legendarily haunted location in Tennessee. All these are haunted this places. This bridge what overlooks the, the very same tracks that a man named George once wanted on to and met a terrible fate uh -huh. now George's angry ghost chases away anyone who says his name three times oh, fuck that. strange magic rituals are also said to be practiced George. out in the woods George isn't even the man George isn't even a good name bro what would I what would I say three times especially if I know if I say it three times there's a motherfucker gonna come out and start whooping my ass I'm not doing that to honor his name and so paranormal activity has become a regular occurrence over the years right. Tonight, a brave YouTuber named Mads Entertainment is ready to settle the uh -huh. legend of Crazy George once and for all. And so right. he goes on a paranormal exploration of the bridge at night from the top to bottom. Crazy George. Mm, Crazy don't George. fucking call him Crazy George, bro. Don't call him Crazy George. Crazy George. Man, Crazy George gonna whoop your ass, bro. The sound what of an approaching fuck? engine turns out to be nothing more than up? oncoming he was traffic. Run his ass they refuse over? to give up the ghost hunt and try to address the paranormal directly by speaking into the night sky. What? If anyone's here, you can come speak into my camera. They are positive that these sound like the noises of a little ghost girl screaming in the woods, possibly a manifestation of black magic rituals in the past. I'm not so sure because I think it could be an animal. Yeah, Here's the sound that. again. Let fuck me know what that. you think this scary voice in the darkness belongs to. Austin? So fuck. Number two. A YouTuber named Outdoors with Eric patrols his property at night because he suspects a mysterious creature in the woods. It's a scary exploration and a creepy location for sure. But Why Eric would you wants do to it get as night? much evidence on Why? camera as Why he can. At night? So he keeps his fear in check and marches forward. 90% of the forward. chance something bad is going to happen minute and if you go outside seconds, at night. He hears some really scary noises coming Come from on, the woods. Man. I don't know what kind of creature would be up late at night screaming in the darkness. You don't know what kind of creature will be up at night, bro. Every literally ninety percent of all animals are n come out at night, bro. So if you go out there at night, they gonna come out there too. Like they out there, you know what I'm saying? Like fuck that. What does it sound like to you? Yeah. That's just he you walks for walking. another minute until the scary noises you give him pause again, much louder and closer this time. Man, you guys hear that? No, I don't hear it. It's probably just you walking. Stop walking! He feels watched and zooms in close with his night vision camera. You can barely make out the shape of a creature at first, so let me point it out for you. That is bizarre. When he plays with the setting, yeah, he is. gets a much better sighting because on the creature, that look, that looks and soon discovers like, there are two of them like, across it look like the anything. stream. They're coming closer. Man, yeah, that's probably just a cow, yeah. bro. Two dots in the distance mark where yeah, he man, thinks they the are. Her, the screaming cub. creatures of the night. No doubt they are real, and so are the scary noises. But the real question no is, doubt. what are they? I've got a challenge for you. Since you've made it this far, why not like this video and okay. hit subscribe in the next okay. five yeah, seconds? Because I upload four new scary videos every week. Mm -hmm. If you're curious about oh, what, what the like fuck? In real life, then go to my Instagram. Why would he do that? Dylan is chillin YT. Why would he that show that? Oh, fuck, this shit got out. me. Oh, that got my one. Ooh. Number a ghost one. hunting group called No Fear Paranormal lives up to their name while exploring a haunted cemetery with a K2 meter, a spirit box, and some recording equipment. The name of the haunted place they're exploring is the Tonopah Cemetery in Nevada. They Fuck ask a it cemetery. a question, but apparently whatever is nearby has only one topic on its I mind. I hate cemeteries. Can you tell us how many of us are out here? How many people are in the cemetery? A scary voice of a man comes through their paranormal equipment and calmly responds with two words, a demon. 
I'm not sure if this is a real ghost EVP or not, but the way it it's immediately not, tells them that a demon TikTok. is nearby is frightening to say the least, yeah, and possibly real, more than a creepy I mean, coincidence. Yeah, no, Exploring abandoned places has gone side. wrong plenty of times Fuck is that. the scary top 5 video show. Okay, yeah, that's it. That's the end of the video. Alright guys, well, I hope you enjoyed. Uh, that was 11 scary videos you shouldn't watch alone. Um, uh, I honestly thought it was going to be like worse, like really bad. Um, but um, no, it was pretty good. Maybe this wasn't as, as scary as I thought it was going to be because I mean literally it was just what? It was Black Panther at first and then it was the horse and then it was some dudes being homeless at the damn at the damn houses um but yeah if you liked it make sure you like and subscribe if you need, if you need me to do more if you want me to do more then uh yeah just comment down below and let me know peace